Hello guys and welcome to my channel. This is Savage YT guys and guys if you are new to my channel guys I suggest you go ahead and there smash the subscribe button like and share this video and without no further ado guys Let's jump right in on today's uh, tutorials guys. So guys on today's tutorial we'll be looking into or rather we'll be answering some question Which is a uh, multi goals guys multi goals question guys. Yeah, I have to raise this up because some people are still um, confused on what multi-goals is and how it works, guys. When we talk about multi-goals, that is the range numbers of goals that would be scored in a particular match within the time given, the first minute of the game to the 90 minutes of the game without the extra time being counting. And guys, these goals is always calculated there between two sides of the gameplay that is between both side side a and side b side a versus side b guys so guys um here is a multi-score guys here is multi-score is always at the end of a uh, every uh spotty bet uh, games guys spotty bet options here is multi goals rather so guys when we talk about multi goals like I said earlier, of, it is the numbers of goals that will be scored in a match between both teams or both sides. Side A versus side B. Let's say Porto or uh, Atletico Madrid versus... Uh, um, is Atletico Madrid and who again? And Lazio, yes. Atletico Madrid versus Lazio, guys. So, guys, we have uh, different kinds of options when it comes to multi-goals. We have one to two goals. We have one to three goals. We have 1 to 4 goals. We have 1 to 5, 1 to 6, 2 to 3, and so on and so forth, as it is stated, guys. So this very question is, what if you choose the 1 to 3 option first half? Guys, I am not saying this, but um, if you have a bookmarker that goes with 1 to 3 uh, multi-goals first half, and the games it ends in a draw-draw, guys, then believe me when I say that, eh? It is quite a, a loss. There was no goal scored in that very game. At this point, you are saying that a goal must definitely be scored. One goal must be scored. And the option is a one to three goals a option. But no goal came out at the end of the game. It ended on a 0-0 draw for tab. Then it is a total loss, guys. So, but if any of the sides would have scored just a goal and the match ended on a 1-0 or 0-1 or... 2-1 or 1-1, then it is still a win-win. But if the game ends in first half, if you selected a first half uh, multi-goals option, 1-3 to three goals, and the, goal, the game ends in a 2-2 two -two draw first half or 3-1 draw or 3-1 win first half, it is a loss. And vice versa in the case of a 3-1, which is 1-3. And guys, um, another person asked the question saying, please, I play multi-goals 1-3 to three. for home and they score exactly 3 goals. But a weight team scored one, yet I lost. How, please? Guys, I think there was a mistake in your option selection, guys. You made a mistake in your selection. Here, we have home multi-goals. And there is no way you can choose home multi-goals one to three. It means that the only people you are expecting to score goals ranging from one to three is the home side. Even if a weight goes ahead to win that game in a 7-1, 7-3, 7-2, 10-2, Whatever the case might be, as long as the home side maintain the goal range of one to three, they are able to score one goal or two goals or three goals without scoring more than that. It is a win, guys. There is no how they can deny you of such a selection, guys. So I'm suggest I'm thinking that uh, you might or may have mistakenly selected the option of a uh, one to three goals option in total multi goals. So that is it. If you select, we have the home multi-goals and we have the away multi-goals, guys. So, that is it. So, guys, when we are talking about multi-goals, like I said before, it is the numbers of goals that would be scored in a match within 90 minutes. Extra time goals are not included. They are not included. Extra time goal. If, per adventure, it is a cup game and the match ends in a 4-3 at the end of the game, it doesn't count. But if at the first half you choose multi-goals, uh, multi one to four goals, and the match ended in a 2-2 draw, it is still a win because the match ended in a four goals, guys. So that is it, guys. That is all you need to understand when we are talking about uh, multi-goals. 
So guys, if you have any other question relating to multi goals, guys, I suggest you go ahead and there, leave a comment at the comment box. And guys, don't forget to smash the subscribe button, like and share this video. And I look forward to seeing you on our next tutorial. Thanks and uh, peace, guys.